we're both from Montreal and how we met we actually met in uh, university and um, yeah it was kind of because I'm kind of a clumsy guy so <laughs> very clumsy. I walked into class and uh, <laughs> I slipped and I fell it, it sounds kind of cheesy and she helped me up and then we started talking and I didn't know anyone in the class because it was my first year of uni and then we became friends and then from there yeah, yeah just everything started growing so. we met in high school <laughs> freshman year yeah yeah had class together oh yeah like three classes three classes and he walked me to class um we met through a tattoo studio i used to work at mm -hmm. yeah, so nice. yeah long distance relationship for two like, years two years yeah he was supposed to be a booty call but then he texted me the next <laughs> morning <laughs> we're both from brazil and brazil has like disney has a college program for people in brazil and like we signed up for it last year and we met through like the selection and stuff so we went together and we're there like for three months and we just got to know each other and I don't know it was like that it was like a first experience for both of us so so you really met on tinder yeah, yeah we did yes, I was on it for a week you were on it for two weeks yeah <laughs> we and met each other yeah and that was it it's been almost a year wow yeah, yeah so it's fun so this time last year um, I was looking for a Valentine's date for fun because I was single. So me and my friend at work, we were like, oh, let's do some prank phone calls. So we prank phone called his work and then we started talking and then about a, probably a week, two weeks later. Yeah, about two. About two weeks later, we met up and we've been together ever since. Well, we both worked at the same company, um, I guess 30 years ago now, uh, over 30 years ago, and we uh, met when we started uh, curling. Uh, it, it's a sport we play in Canada for the for the same company. Nice. Yeah. yeah, and we, uh, like Sharon said, uh, we hung out after curling and became good friends, and one thing led to another, and then uh, we got married. Right? Yeah, we've married 30 years now. <laughs> 30 years. We were in this place, a park near our school, and uh, I kind of was skateboarding. It was on Halloween. Yeah. I had nothing to do. I was wearing these shoes. <laughs> And uh, I was like, yo, I'm feeling wavy right now. I'm feeling fresh. I saw Brianna. Our homie Monrovia was like, yo, go talk to her. Yeah, she calls you babe behind your back. I was like, word? So I was like, right, <laughs> I'm gonna go say something. So I walked over there. I was like, hi, I'm Miles. And then what'd you say? What you I saying? was like, hi, being all shy and shit. And I had like a mini costume on, just, just the nose and the ears and stuff. And then I was just like, hi. And all my friends were like pushing me towards him. It was just like, yeah. Yeah, and then I was like, I, I can't run away because I'm already here. So <laughs> we started talking, and then a couple later, weeks later, yeah, you got to see that. Did I, did I, yeah, I think I put his number, or we exchanged numbers. Yeah, we exchanged numbers somehow. It happened. That's all. It, we got numbers into numbers, and yeah. My mother had invited me to a New Year's Eve party, and I was reluctant to go because I said it's just going to be a bunch of old people and everyone's going to be asleep by 10 o'clock, and oh. So I went to work, I showed up late, I arrived at the door, I only had one dress, it happened to be a beautiful, beautiful bias cut red chiffon, but, um, and I was just, you know, kind of threw it on, went to the party, got to the door, the hostess said, are you alone? Well, yeah, it looks like I am. And uh, she said, well, there's two brothers right here, and they're as far as I am from you now. And one of them was my husband, the other was his brother, and for some reason, my husband and I worked out. <laughs>